Hey guys, Penguin Recordings here, and today I'm going to showcase how to install Origin on Ubuntu. This is Ubuntu 13.10, but this should work for 12.04, 12.10, 13.04, and hopefully future versions of Ubuntu. So the first thing you're going to need is uh, Play on Linux, all right. And in Play on Linux, make sure that it is version 4.1.8 or newer okay this is necessary make sure that it's newer than 4.1.8 I'm using 4.2.2 here okay so close that the second part is that you're going to need the origin setup.exe this is very important origin thin setup the usual download does not work no matter how many times you try to install this it will not work when you try to install the thin setup the thin setup you will get this error right here let me zoom in on this if I can okay this is the error right here that you will get from wine itself and it will redirect you to this link right here okay this link I will provide in the description down below if you need to copy and paste it or if you want to see it you can pause the video right here just to take a look at it okay this is it once you have that downloaded make sure you download it some way you remember I put it on the desktop so it is called origin setup.exe Notice the difference in the names. All right, we want this one, origin setup.exe. Now that we have that out of the way, I'm going to be using the latest wine because it is so far the least buggiest that I've experienced. For this, you will need to go to tools, manage wine versions. Okay, and you're going to select wine 1.7.13 on the left. I already did this and I've already installed it. You will select it on the left, you will click this arrow button here, it will install itself and then it will appear on the right. So once it's on the right, you have it installed. Okay, let's close that. Now let's actually install Origin. Click the install button, go to the bottom left, install a non-listed program. Click that. Click next. We are going to click the first one, install a program in a new virtual drive. Click next. Now this is the name of the drive. You can name it anything you want, but to make it easier for me, I'm going to name it origin test. All right. I'm going to click next. I'm going to tick use another version of wine because we're going to be using wine 1.7.13. And I'm going to configure wine to put it into windowed mode. It's always safer to put it into windowed mode first when you're testing. Okay, click next. Here we select the Wine version and if you've installed Wine 1.7.13 as I have previously shown, you will find it in the list. Here it is. Select it and click next. Now it's installing, setting up Wine. Give it a couple of seconds while it sets up the virtual drive for this. Okay, here I'm going to set it into windowed mode. This is the one configuration. So go to graphics tab up here. Go to the bottom left here and tick emulate a virtual desktop. This is optional, but I highly suggest you do it in case of any anomalies. I'm setting the resolution to 1600 by 900 set it appropriately so that it can fit within your screen if you have a smaller resolution then please put that smaller resolution click apply and click ok here is where we browse to go to the origin setup which is on the desktop Click browse click desktop and click origin setup.exe okay click open click next and this is where we begin the installation just simply click install. Don't change any of that. There's no need to. Let it install itself. So this might take longer or might take shorter depending on your system. I agree. As you can see, there's no text here, but that's okay. We, most people don't read the agreement anyway. But if you need to, then you can probably find a version of this online. Click OK. All right, it's starting up. So as you can see, we've installed Origin, but the installation procedure, according to Play on Linux, we're still installing. So don't worry about that. Now I'm going to log in to show that it does work. 
Okay. I am hiding my account details. You should use your own account details for this. Remember me, login as invisible. Hopefully I did it correctly. Login. Nope, I did not do it correctly. Let me redo that. Okay. It's logging in. So you can see it works so far, the login part at least. Starting up. Okay. So we have the main uh, origin client running here. This is the store. As you can see, it's a lot smoother. Previous wine versions wouldn't render this properly and it really bug out, but in the latest wine, it does seem to work well. So you can browse the store. I can go to my games and browse all the games I have. I have not installed anything, so I don't know yet if it's possible to run any of these games through Origin via Wine. I'm not sure yet. The last thing I ever tried was Battlefield 3 and that did not work, but that was due to DirectX 11. Whether or not my other games work is highly possible, but I'll have to try it at a later date. This is basically how you install Origin. One thing I will note is that I don't know what these things are in the back. In all honesty, I have no idea what these things in the back are. They start up when you start the game up and I honestly don't know what they are, so I close them anyway. So I'm going to exit Origin. Alright, so the installation procedure is done. Now this is where we choose the shortcut. Okay, this is important because later on when you want to run it through Play on Linux, you need the shortcut. I'm going to click this. If I'm not wrong, this is the correct shortcut. Click Next. You can name the shortcut anything you want, but I'm just going to name it Origin Test because I already have Origin installed previously. I don't want it to conflict. Everything's done. Click that and click Next. So there you have it. You've installed Origin. It's very simple and most of this video is pretty much just me giving advice. The installation procedure, the only thing you need to know is use the latest wine and make sure that you're using originsetup.exe. The thin setup does not work. So now that you have it installed, you've closed it, maybe you want to run it again, open up Play on Linux, select it here, and then click Run. Alright, and that's how you start up Origin in Wine. So it automatically logs me in. So as you can see, putting in uh, wrong login information works, putting in right login information works, having it automatically log in for you also works. And this is the store. Everything is okay and works fine. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope this helps you set up Origin. Whether or not you can get the games running is an entirely different deal. But for now, this is hopefully one step in the right direction. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope this helps you.